Hi, my name is Patrice Daniels. I am 40 years old. I am married. I have one child. Um, I live in Georgia. I am the sibling of, uh, I have five other siblings. I am the youngest of six children. Um, let's see here. Um, so today I just wanted to do my first YouTube vlog. Um, I've been watching YouTube for a few years now. I am, you know, um, a I have subscribed to several YouTube um, vloggers and um, I just thought, hey, you know, um, I just been thinking about this for a long time. I said, hey, might as well go ahead and get myself out there, go ahead and start vlogging my videos um, and just on just real life experiences, um, different situations, um, just day to day normal um, activities of my life. Um, I work in the medical field. I'm an oral surgeon scheduler. Um, I have been doing it for a few years now. Um, have great um, co-workers, great patients. Um, so I just decided, hey, why not today be the first day that I start vlogging my first YouTube um, vlog and just get my channel out there. Um, with my channel, I just hope that it brings positivity, um, just enlighten, encourage someone, um, just uplift women, young females, young girls. Um, I have um, been through a lot of my life, have experienced a lot of my life, can write books on my life, um, testimonies on my life, um, how God have just brought me through a lot of difficult situations. Um, so. I decided, you know what, hey, just go for it now with the coronavirus, so I'm home a lot, and so I got a lot of free time on my hands um, just to go ahead and vlog, so um, with my channel, I just want um, it to be relatable um, to a lot of people, um, nothing just, um, nothing to down anyone nothing to bring negativity always positivity um i'm not sure if i'm going to do any pranks or not um not sure but i am sure that um it will be positive um and um just i just want positive vibes positive comments um and things like that i'm you know i'm an amateur i'm not I'm new to this, never done this before, so this is all new to me. Um, I, I am happy, I am excited of where this can take me. And also, you can see I'm natural with my natural hair. I've been natural since, I think, 2005 or 2006. So, um, I'm not sure. Um, want to try new stuff, kind of in between on relaxing again or keeping, you know, keeping it natural. I'm just getting tired of, you know, being 40 years old and with a ponytail, so I want to look more mature or whatever even when i go to work so i'm like okay i'm kind of i don't know about the natural state anymore and i'm not really um doing right by my hair not deep conditioning like i supposed to not just really really going all in with my hair sorry about the lighting as well i'm sitting in the living room trying to um find a spot where i'm comfortable with vlogging um, my video and also if you guys hear dogs in the back we have um two Yorkie mixed with Pomeranian um, dogs. Um, the female is Bella and the male is Louie. And then Bella just had three puppies. Um, they are five weeks old. They'll be six weeks old on Friday. So I am selling two puppies. If you guys are interested in Yorkie mixed Pomeranian, just um, you can reach me. Um, you contact me on Facebook. It's Patrice Clemens Daniels. Um, if you guys interested, all of them are girls. I'm deciding about keeping one so the mother still have one of the puppies left with her. Um, um, however, so my video is not perfect. I'm not perfect. I'm just a woman just trying to succeed, just trying to um, live my life to the fullest, just trying to live a better life. Um, just trying to share um, some of the knowledge that I have um, come across, just trying to share some wisdom, some knowledge on some people that needs it um, or whatever. So, you know, hey, I'm just all about living life, trying to laugh, trying to create um, forever memories um, of positivity, um, no drama, 
laid back, um, then still trying to learn the makeup. Um, to, I'm an amateur at that too. Don't do a lot of makeup. Um, just eyeshadow, you know, here and there. Um, learning all of this stuff is all new to me. Need to go get my nails done, but Corona has put a stop to that. Um, needed to fill in like two weeks ago. But however, everything is closed down here in Georgia, pretty much um, nail salon, beauty salon, um, a lot of places. Um, so we just, I've just been going to work um, probably twice a week, if that, or one day a week. Um, we have cut back. We only see emergencies only. So everything has been changing. But for the positive, you know, a lot of people say, oh, I'm bored being home. You know, I'm a homebody anyway. So I'm loving it, loving the time with the family, loving the time. I can sit on my couch. I can lay on my couch, um, pull a movie out, um, watch Netflix, um, do what I want to do on my time and not, you know, being put on no one else's time and so I'm just loving, loving all of this. Um, I would love to work from home if possible, um, but I go into work um, when I have to work. We have an office. Um, takes me about 10 minutes to get to work, um, two and then 10 minutes to get back from work. So everything is just, you know, it's okay. We're going to be okay. You know, stay positive through um, this crisis, you know, through all things, you know, trust God. Keep your faith where it needs to be and believe that all things work, you know, for the good, you know, and there's nothing too hard for him and it's nothing too hard that he will put on us. Um, he won't put more on us than we can bear. And that's the word of God. So stay encouraged, you know, don't panic, um, you know, no anxiety, you know, just trust God's plan. He said no evil will come near your dwelling, you know, and so apply the blood of Jesus to your life. Apply, you know, around, you know, your your relatives, everyone connected to you. Apply the blood of Jesus, you know, pray, seek his face. Um turn to him and not in this crisis but every day you know we need his strength to keep going on to persevere through life trials you know heartaches you know headaches you know just stress alone we need the lord every day of our lives you know to you know keep us going you know and just to see things like he see them out of his perspective out of his you know eyesight out of his vision you know just see things how the lord sees them you know we may think that this is bad but this is not bad compared to the lord you know and he will give us strength and he will give us strategies. He will give us insight and hindsight of what's going on, what is to come, what we need to be doing. But stay encouraged, stay prayerful, getting your word, you know, just meditate on him. Think about the goodness of the Lord and all that he has already done for us, you know, and all that he's already brought you out, you know. It's nothing too hard, and you know, with the Lord, He don't want the limits to be put on Him, but He want the limits to be taken off of Him, so He can show everyone that our God is big. He's an everlasting God. He's the same God as yesterday, today, and forever. You know, He said He will be with us even to the ends of the earth. So I'm trusting and believing and standing on the Word and apply it to your life and see the manifestation of God manifest in your life and the people around you lives. You know, just don't pray for yourself, but pray for others. You know, in this time, check on others, check on the elderly. You know, you see someone struggling um, in the store, you know, be a helping hand, you know, or whatever. It does not matter if they are a stranger or not you know what i'm saying sometimes we enter entertain angels unaware and that's the word of god so just be encouraged encourage someone else smile give someone else a, a a loving smile and you know just show them that guess what we're all in it together and we can all overcome it together it's nothing that our god will not do he will sustain us he will provide he will provide shelter food everything that we need um he is our re refuge um in the time of all troubles so when you want to go in your safety place run to him he is your your safety place yes he is your safety place so i thank all you guys for watching this is my first youtube vlog um give me a thumbs up leave some comments share like 
leave only positivity, no negativity. You know, it's time for us to encourage one another, love one another, and just show one another kindness. Us as women, we downplay each other too much or we hate on each other too much. It's time to love, uplift, and encourage and push push our sisters to be better, to be wiser. We're getting older. We're not getting younger. And when we get older, we're supposed to become more mature, more knowledgeable, more, we're supposed to gain more wisdom. So let's leave wisdom for one another. Let's, you know, embrace one another, no matter how others look, no matter how they carry themselves, that you just know that God is able to do anything that we need him to do in this season, in this time of our life. You know, just trust God through it all. He is a blessing. He is a way maker. Sorry, you guys, I had to come in the kitchen and check on my food that I'm cooking. Um, I am cooking for the family right now. Got some roast on, got some llama beans, got some rice. So I'm a Southern type of girl. So with that being said, I love country food. I love llama beans. I love roast rice, baked macaroni and cheese, cornbread, collard greens, you name it. I love it. I love, love, love country food. I am a country girl. So everything that my grandmother used to cook, beans, peas, you know, everything, okra. A lot of people don't like okra. I love okra and stuff like that. So I am a country girl. I love, love, love to eat. And sorry about the kitchen. We're doing some painting. We still got some tape up. Um, trying to just remodel the house, trying to fix up. Um, just trying to move. We're moving a little slow with things being that Corona. So we got to make sure that, um, our, funds is still where it needs to be in case we need to use them so everything that we need to do we need to do it with wisdom so with that being said i will show you my puppies right quick this is mr louie and this is bella i don't know why she is laying like that and these are the little puppies that she had so they are just resting right now they they will make a lot of noise shortly after if they any little noise that they hear um they bark and they bark for hours oh my goodness um they love attention and then plus it's raining outside so you guys may hear the rain but however like i said my name is patrice this is my first vlog um just share like and comment and subscribe thank you bye